Hi everybody, my name is Sherry Thompson and I'm from Rappahannock Area Community Service Board. And for my craft activity today, uh, we're going to make a ghost pumpkin hanger. Um, you just need some paper, any kind of paper that you want. I have some that has some designs on it and some that is plain. You need some cookie cutters. I picked a ghost and a pumpkin to use on my hanger. And then you need some scissors, of course. And you need some glue. And of course a pencil for tracing or a marker or even a crayon and you need some ribbon I chose this ribbon to use and then you can either have a small one or a large ribbon for the tie on the top which I'll explain as we get along okay so first thing we want to do is I'm gonna go ahead and lay the pumpkin on the paper you're gonna trace it like so maybe not be able to see it okay then I'm going to cut the pumpkin out and I know you guys are all great cutters so I know you won't have any problems with this make sure you also again as I always say make sure you ask your parents for some help if you have difficulty and then once we are finished then I have my pumpkin cut out I've cut out some ghosts too and some other pumpkins so I can pick whichever ones that I want to put on my hanger. So here's the hanger. I already started it. So I have a pumpkin, a ghost, a pumpkin, a ghost. And at the top of it, what I need you to do is I need you to fold it over, take a little pair of scissors and snip it right there to make a little bit of a hole. Make sure that you ask your parents to help you with that because it's kind of difficult to hold the scissors and hold the folding on it. So take your ribbon then. I chose the little skinny little ribbon. I like that one for it. Put it through the hole. And then I'm going to tie a little knot in it like so, so that we are able to hang it up once we're finished with our beautiful Halloween hanger so we have it just like that that's all you need is just to be able to hang it up so I have a pumpkin a ghost a pumpkin a ghost so what do you think goes next a pumpkin okay so we're gonna go ahead and put a little bit of glue on the paper and then we're going to add a pumpkin I'm gonna go ahead and use this purple one and I'm going to make it go this way and that's all you're going to do is just add it and then I think I put maybe one more on here let's see if I can get the ghost on there as yep I have enough room for the ghost so I'm going to go ahead and put a little bit more glue down and Let's see, I did that way, this way. So let's do the opposite of the ghost that I have here. And then we'll glue it on. And then there is your hanger. And you can hang it up. And it has lots of pumpkins and ghosts on it. So it's an easy project. You don't need too many things. I hope you enjoy it. And I hope you find a great place to hang it up. Thank you very much for joining me. You guys have a great weekend. Thank you.